Katie Price's Christmas plans have been salvaged after she swerved jail today over her drink drive crash in September. The former glamour model, 43, had been hoping to have a quiet Christmas with her 19-year-old son Harvey and her fiancé Carl Woods in her infamous Mucky Mansion, and she's got her wish. The mum of five previously revealed that she will be without her other children this year due to the fact they will be spending the festivities with their dads, so Katie had her heart set on a wonderful Christmas with her two boys instead. The plan is that Harvey will be home for Christmas and New Year. It will be me, Harvey and Carl. I don't have the other kids this year as it's their dad's turns because I had them last year, she told OK! Magazine. Katie had also planned on paying a visit to her terminally ill mum this Christmas, as she gushed over her joy at finally being back in her Horsham mansion for good. And then obviously I'll see my mum and my family. We'll be at my house in Horsham, I'm back here for good and I'm loving it, Katie told. Katie was sentenced today after she pleaded guilty to drink driving, driving whilst disqualified and driving without insurance, in October. The mother of five crashed her BMW on a country road in September and admitted to driving whilst intoxicated. At a previous hearing at Crawley Magistrates Court, Chair of the Bench Julie Hutton agreed to defer sentencing until today on the condition that Katie attended the Priory Rehab Clinic, not commit any further offences, and be banned from driving in the meantime. Katie then enrolled on a program at the Priory for treatment in order to seek help in battling her addiction issues under the supervision of professionals. It wasn't the first time that Katie has had a stint at the facility as she checked into rehab in September 2018 in order to tackle her drug issues. She spent 28 days in the facility after deciding to receive professional help after depending on cocaine to numb the pain of her problems. Katie has since said that she deeply regrets getting behind the wheel of her car in the early hours of the morning. In a recent YouTube teaser, Katie said, I got behind the wheel of the car. I regret it. I have upset people around me, and I have upset myself. I could have been hurt or I could have been dead. I could have killed someone, or I could have injured someone. Katie was handed a 16-week prison sentence, suspended for 12 months. Katie will also have to undergo 100 hours of unpaid work in community. Her driving ban has been kept to two years and Katie will not have to take an extended driving test. There will be no separate penalty for the charge of driving without insurance, 